So I'm out here at First Energy Park in Lakewood speaking with Aaron Altair. And Aaron, you know, you're off to a pretty solid start here. Average above 300, getting back in, uh, stealing bags here, just like, uh, you know, is your style. Just talk about, you know, coming back here to Lakewood this year in 2012 and uh, having the success like uh, you would want to. Uh, for me, I just wanted to come back here and uh, just stay consistent, not let anything like, get to me like I did last year. You know, whatever happens, happens. It's my philosophy, and uh, I just try to stay consistent, really. Okay, cool. And, um, you know, you went back to Williamsport last year after a couple months here with Lakewood, and um, just wanted to kind of get your feel on that. You know, was that, um, you know, after have, after having a tough stretch and kind of have, having to go through, a, a, you know, what is really a demotion, you know, is that something that's discouraging or something that you can really use to refuel and refocus? Uh, it's a little bit of both. At first, I was a little disappointed, of course, but, uh, you know, I, Got there, made the most of it, and uh, just I was, I was with a great team, great coach, and uh, they really got me, got me going again. Absolutely, you mentioned uh, having a great coach, which was manager Mickey Morandini, who follows you up a step this year uh, here with Lakewood, and you know uh, Mickey's kind of. Uh, He's really out there with his with his philosophy on baseball. He likes small ball. He's got a lot of speedy guys on the team this year. You're one of them. Um, you know, does that kind of play into your your preferable style of baseball? Playing that small ball, playing that swipe bags, take everything you can. Oh yeah, definitely. Because I'm I don't really hit a lot of home runs, so I, I like to get on base, get, like to steal, like to score runs. So it's. He definitely plays into what I, how I play. Okay. Also, wanted to ask you just your thoughts on Mickey. You know, you said he's a, a good coach, and uh, clearly, uh, you know, I'm talking to just people here in the in the first month on the team uh, this season, uh, people that have been with him for a couple of years, even uh, like yourself. Just just some thoughts on him. A lot, I get a lot of good feedback. What are, what are your thoughts on Mickey Morandini? Oh, he's a great guy. He laid back. You know, he's not not raw raw kind of guy. You know, it's which is uh, you know what I like, and um, you know, just real chill. You know. Great, great, great manager. Yeah, absolutely. Great you game. mentioned, um, you know, taking the time to, to refocus and, and recharge and, uh, you know, just get everything right to come back here and do this right again in your second turn through uh, Lakewood. Uh, just what improvements have you made over the past year and, you know, where do you see yourself going forward this year? I uh, just, just got stronger. I just uh, I got a little, I hit a lot during the offseason. Got more consistent hitting on the barrel. And, uh, you know, I just, just plan to. Keep, keep keep it going and uh, hopefully get called up or something, you know, whatever, whatever happens. I guess. Okay, right on. And now you're one of the, the guys on this roster that's pretty well regarded as far as pro prospect rankings and things like that go. Um, you know, does that, does that, uh, is that something that kind of gets into your outlook? And, um, you know, and, and on top of that, I was going to ask you, do you think uh, aside from yourself and guys like uh, Michael Franco who – are, are on these types of lists. Um, is there anybody on the team that you feel you feels underrated? So, firstly, how does it affect your outlook to have that kind of recognition? And then, secondly, is there anybody that you feels deserve you feel deserves more recognition on the roster? Um, my outlook, I, I really don't pay attention to it anymore. Like I did last year, but I decided not to do it this year. Okay. And you know, basically, everybody on the team is can can be a top prospect. I mean, everybody's everybody's good. We're just having, having a little rough stretch right now, but we'll, we'll get into it. We'll get back.